defeat the Selkidamas and get a boatload of snails, Ida won't have to worry about money for a long time. King want a cracker! All hands! All right, crew! The Selkidamas has been ravaging the coastline. It was last seen in the simmering shoals. You know the drill? Snag the quarry, get the money galore. We all do the work, we all get a cut. I have many deaths. Till then, keep everything ship shape. This ain't no pleasure cruise. Don't be a burden, Sea Squirt. Oh, you don't have to worry about me. <laughs> Confront my own biases, and I got nothing but respect for you now, Squirt. I mean, sailor. Thanks, Salty. You make me feel like a real part of the crew. Well, that's because you are. Yeah! <laughs> oh! Hey, that's mine, you feather duster. Yeah! Oof! Hey, King, want a cracker? Ooh. <laughs> huh? Is that the Emperor's sigil? This ship belongs to the Emperor? Oh boy, I gotta tell Luce. Unfortunately, you won't have the chance. <laughs> okay, next is... Fire bee honey. How can I get fire bee honey without ice magic or porcupine quills without a sleeping spell? Who am I without magic? Without a coven? Without friends? Hmm. I said you don't know how to get those fire bees, but I can help. No, I don't want your help. I told you not to follow me. If I were you, I would. You would what? Because it doesn't matter. You aren't me. You're just some kind of weird bird worm. You have no idea what I'm going through. I have to do this alone, because if I can't, what kind of witch am I? Sorry, Lulu. I mean, sorry, Lilith. Now, let's try this one more time. We're here. The simmering shows. Ours peeled, mates. She's close. She's here!
Okay, we've covered every glyph I've learned up until now. So today, we'll learn something new. Are we about to encounter a never-before-seen glyph? Unfortunately, no. These four either came from nature or another witch's spell. I, I don't know where to find more. In any case, today we're learning how to alter glyphs to do specific things. Uh, Miss Teacher, did I do it right? Yeah, that's really good. Let's see how you're doing, Ida. I don't think that's such a good... Double glyph combo, go! Oh, dang. I was hoping for more of an ice blast situation. I know you're impatient to get your powers back, but... Try to master the basics before you start experimenting. Ugh, you're as boring as Lily. Toot toot! The Hexide train is a-coming! Chugga chugga! Uh, okay, uh, King's in charge while I'm gone. Bye! Ha <laughs> ha! Power! Yes! Teacher's gone! <sighs> hmm, I wonder what other combos I can try. Teacher said we're supposed to master the basics before... Basics are so basic. Yeah, if we want to be powerful again, we're going to have to start thinking outside the box. If we want to be powerful again, we have to use glyphs perfectly. And we can only do that through memorization, repetition, and following the rules. Well, I'm more interested in experimentation, innovation, and uh, laughing at tools, like you. Ah! <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, I'll deal with it. No one ever said power came with responsibility. Okay, first day back after the petrification ceremony. Just be chill. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh! Oh, 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 Luce, you're okay! Whoa, guys, did I uh, miss a birthday or something? Which puberty? I can't thank you guys enough for helping me and Ida at the conformatorium. That's cool. I just hope it helps Ida learn my name. She keeps calling me Goops. Hey, Goops. It's already spreading. Hey, Luce. Amity! In celebration of your return, I have brought you a homemade fairy pie. Oh, wow! That sounds so... <laughs> Good. The ingredients are very fresh. Thank you. You know, after everything that's happened, I'm just happy to return to some sense of normalcy. You can just barge in here. Yes, we can. We are the Parent Creature Association. Luce Noceta, Willow Park, and Augustus Porter. Report to Principal Bump's office now. And you too, Amity. Mom? The abomination situation. The destruction of detention. The rampage of Grom. These are but a few of the incidents that have endangered Hexide students, including our daughter. So, the PCA has decided... Ahem. Oh, right. Um, these three are bad influences and must be executed. <gasps> <clears throat> I mean expelled. What? What? Take this as a lesson, Mittens. A blight always upholds their end of the deal. <gasps> Sadly, I have no choice in the matter. Luce, Willow, Augustus. Effective immediately, you are no longer students of Hexide. No, but us! Good! Amity! Tell them! Good. Now, you'll be taking double the classes to make up for lost time. Actually, I'm appalled that you're not in class right now. What are you thinking? Right. Sorry. <laughs> no! Please! Uh, wait! Uh, please. Stop! No! No! Wait! No! Wait! No! Oh, my goodness! Amity! Ah. your help. I think Francois is trying to start a rebellion. In a minute, King. I'm getting so close to figuring out this glyph combo. It's always glyphs and portals with you these days. What about King? Why don't you ask Lilith for help? She was in the Emperor's Coven. She has more experience with unruly mobs than anyone. <laughs> Watching the ink dry is the best part. Uh. A fresh cup of tea for my favorite cup of tea! That's you, Lulu! Well, Hootsifer, you truly are a gem. How do you always know what to do? What's going on? Is Hootie blackmailing her? Oh, I think they're actually friends. Isn't that nice? Okay, this'll work for sure. Now you see me. <gasps> now you don't. Oh, I guess it only lasts as long as I hold my breath. Still pretty cool, huh? Don't ever do that again! Do that again? How ever did you accomplish it? Well, 
Since you guys discovered that we can make new spells by combining glyphs, I've been experimenting. I got the invisibility idea from your history books, Lilith. Fascinating. As the lead historical scholar of the Emperor's Coven, my aid could be very helpful in- oh! An ambush! Men, defend your ruler! I'm done for, Lulu! Hootsifer, this is make-believe. Ah, to die in your arms! Avenge me! What? The king of demons yields to no one! Historically, demons have never been united under a single rule until Bellos. There's no such thing as a king of demons. Blasphemy! Clearly you know nothing of my reign of terror. Allow me to tell you. I was once the mighty king of demons. I was beloved almost as much as I was feared. But one dark day, an evil spell was cast, transforming me into this. Oh! What happened to your crown of power? A trifle. That was just to test Ida and Luce's dedication to me. They passed. My real crown is still out there. But when I shrank, my memories got a fuzzy. How convenient. A hole in your memory for each hole in your story. <laughs> nice one, Lulu! Up top! <laughs> hey, I remember plenty. I remember armies bowing before me, being served the greatest of feasts and falling from a massive height as that evil hex shrank me. One day, I'll return to my rightful place, and all shall fear me! Why, oh, you're gonna be such a good tyrant. Who's the scariest demon king? <laughs> Who is it? <laughs> me! It's me! Your dedication to this farce would be charming if it weren't so sad. Don't blame me for your ignorance. I'm not a liar, and I can prove it. Uh, he called me ignorant! Me! Stop it, you guys. This story is really important to him. So the least we can do is play along. You mean indulge his silly fantasy. Yeah, I'm a house of principles. You're asking me to lie? Outrageous! Could you please just go with it for his sake? All right, you two shall regret ever doubting me. We're going to my castle. Uh... What's wrong, Luce? I thought you said we should just... Go with... go with him. I said we should go with him, right? How could I forget what I just said? My historical expertise is being questioned, and I will not allow it. Hootie, would you like to accompany us? <gasps> oh, get ready! <gasps> Porta Hootie, reporting for Hootie. <laughs> Hmm? Where'd everyone go? Man, they made a mess in here. Oh well, it's been a while since I had room to put my feet up. Off to my real castle. Don't wait up. Love, your favorite demon overlord. Oh no, not again. Oh! Are we still flying? It's been hours! Should we call it a day? Or perhaps a night? <laughs> Moody, your sense of humor is infectious. There it is! <laughs> this island shouldn't be here. It's not on any of the maps. It's always been there when I looked for it. After I shrunk, I woke up here in Ida's arms and she carried me away. Like a little baby. Aww. <sighs> uh, fine. Aw. As I was saying, I've had the portal door for years, but I originally just found it in the dirt. Never figured out who made it or where it came from. I just kept it to myself. Why wouldn't you tell anyone? What? Suddenly curious about my past? Always, always curious. Well, I may have been using it to hide from someone. Hide from who? Probably me! <laughs> Magic bird tornado? Hello, little witchlet. Come here. Gwendolyn. Mm. Oh, are we still on that? I'm your mother. Call me mom. Mom? It is so good to see you again. 
How are you feeling? Are you eating well? I heard all about the petrification ceremony. Trust me, I have a lot of strong words for that bellows. Mother! Mother. You know, I was there too. Oh, hello to you too, sweet flea. Oh, still dyeing your hair, I see. Well, it's very sleek. Now, give me a moment with Edelin, dear. It's important. That's right. Today, I am about to complete a 30-year mission. Oh, no. Your mother has finally succeeded. Here it comes. Today, I shall be curing your curse! No thanks. What? what? I said no thanks. I got my elixir system. I'm good. But, but who knows what they put in those nasty concoctions? Actually, I do. And uh, would you look at the time? I got a lot to do today. So sad to see you go. Okay, bye! Moms, am I right? I haven't seen Mother in forever! And she was handing you a cure on a silver platter! I'd kill to see my mom right now, and you just launch yours into the sky? Oh, listen. She comes around every year toting a new cure for my curse. But they never work. So I am done getting my hopes up. Mother visits Edelin regularly? Mrs. Clawthorn? Wait! I'm loose. Ida's apprentice? I think what you're doing is so sweet. Ida can just be so... Ida sometimes. Call me Gwen, dear. But please don't blame Edelin. It was the curse that created the rift between us. I understand. Right now, there's an actual rift between me and my mom in the human realm. Human realm? Hmm. My dear, I may know how to fix both our rifts. Really? I've heard some information that may assist you on your quest. Help me cure Ida's curse, and that information is yours. Yes, 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 yes! Where do we start? We'll be consulting someone very special. So we're gonna meet a curse expert? This is so rad! Yes, after years of dealing with the Healing Coven, I finally found someone who promised me a cure. Ah, here we are! Master Wartlop. He's a traveling curse expert who's perfected next level healing magic. Oh! Ah. Gwendolyn, my pupil, your aura is shining bright. It took many months, but I was able to gather the sacred items you requested the copper egg from the snowy rib cage, the silver dagger from the swampy toes, and the golden chalice from the desert of palm stings. You're a dedicated mother, aren't you? Inside this tome is the healing ability you seek. But keep it away from the eyes of non-believers, for many will be blinded by the power it holds. I understand. I am in your debt, Master Wartlop. Isn't it amazing, Francois? If Ida's mom can just pop up, who says my dad can't? Yeah, better get my hugging arms ready. Ha! Yeah, good luck with all that dad stuff. Sometimes it doesn't matter how dutiful you are or successful you are. Parents just won't give you the time of day. Don't listen to her, Francois. My dad won't be like that. Right. Your mysterious father, who didn't even stick around to watch you hatch. Looks like you and I are in the same boat, King. <laughs> nice work, Luce. With Wartlob's tome and your ability to lure Ida out of the house, we'll be curing that curse in no time. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she's always down for more apple blood. So, that Wartlob guy was really something. You're his pupil? Oh, yes. But first, I had to prove that I was worthy of his secrets. So I spent the last year on a bunch of dangerous quests. And I didn't even get that many scars. Cool. Also, dang girl, your bicep game is ridiculous. <gasps> Our signs must have worked. Oh, 
baby. Time to stock up on Mama's night juice. According to Wartlop's tome, we start by lowering the beast's defenses with special crystals. They're supposed to be quite calming. Whoa! Ah! Huh. Knife season came early this year. Hey, Gus. Thanks for sending me all those get well soon illusions, but, uh... Willow! How you feeling? Do you have a fever? Oh, Willow, you want me to sing for you? Me, Willow, me, is this me, helping? Me, 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 Can you please me. take them back? Uh. Where's Willow? Why are we here? Did we do bad? No! Oh. Oh. Gustafur! Gustaban! Augustabeth! Any of those working for you? You need my library card to visit Amity, don't you? <laughs> I haven't been doing a good job of hiding that. Huh. Well, I was also hoping to do a little bit of research. Come on. Oh! So, Ida's mom told me I'm not the first human to have lived in Bonesboro. If that's true, there might be some info on how they got here in the library. Yeah, okay. Looking through old newspapers is about all I'm good for anyway. Spell it, Gustanimo. Are you okay? I've just been thinking. What if it's time for me to explore different kinds of magic? I'm all for trying new things. But what's wrong with illusions? Illusions are just so... You know... Son, are you okay? Yes, Daddy. Thank you, mysterious heroes. Stay safe out there. Wow. Just wow. Plants, abomination, construction. You guys took down that slither beast like it was nothing. Nah, it wasn't that easy. Yeah, looked like you had a real hard time out there. You're Glanda students, right? I go to Hexai. Name's Gus. Nice to meet you. This is Angmar, Gavin. Hey. And I'm real. I would have helped, but, like, there was this other baby in danger you probably couldn't see. Metholomule? Augustus? Back off, twerp. This operation is Glandis kids only. Hey, Maddie, it's all cool. Did you get the map? Yes, and I only had to endure 35 nuggies from my older brother. Nice work. Well, uh, I can see you guys are busy, so I... Uh... Wait, have you ever heard of the Galder Stones? They're powerful relics. Many witches and demons have sought them. But they've all returned empty-handed, haunted by its guardian. Until us! We heard some coven scouts talking about them, but it'll be rough going. You said you were a Hexite student, right? We could use the extra strength. That sounds awesome, but I, I can't. I promised a friend I'd help her with something today. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <sighs> Guys, you ran away so fast, but I didn't want to interrupt, so... <laughs> I think you should go. Well, he can't. Gus is just an illusionist. He will only hold his back. Ha! Huh, shows what you know. Gus here is a regular super witch. Loose! I see what you're doing, and it's really sweet, but I don't actually know any spells besides illusions. No problem. Come on, man. You know I'm all about proving jerks wrong. All right, I'm in. Where do we find these golder stones? We're journeying to... The Looking Glass Ruins in Forearm Forest. What's wrong, Augustus? <laughs> Scared? We all are. Who knows what awaits us out there? But we all got each other's backs, right? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, all right. Let's go. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, little Echo Mouse. Read the diary that can get me home. Can't you cough up a teeny bit? Just squeeze it out! <laughs> hmm, maybe I just need to be patient? Please tell me your secrets. Hey, Knucklehead, you're gonna be late for school. All right, I guess you won't be getting a magic staff with your classmates. Come on, Ida, we gotta fly! There we go. <laughs> Hey, Willow. Shouldn't Amity be here? Oh, sorry, Luce. I heard she stayed home today. Oh, <laughs> that 
actually makes sense. Good tidings on this momentous day. You're all about to receive your witch's staffs, and more importantly, meet your palisman. This is a crucial step in your magical development. Palismen are lifelong partners. They can become both your good friends and a powerful tool. In my case... Holy wow. Titan! Free win here helps me see. Now, traditionally, young witches carve their staffs from the branch of an old palestrum tree. But sadly, palestrum trees are becoming more rare, and those that remain are guarded covetously. That's why I've teamed up with Bumpy Poo. Never call me that. To bring you... Palisman Adoption Day! Oh, oh they're so cute! Thanks for the favor, BQ. Here's your whistle back. Save it for another time. This was my pleasure. What a wonderful idea. Nope, you're staying right here. Aw, a rascal. These little ones have not had homes in many years. They want to feel a connection. Kneel and state your deepest wish, and your light-minded partner will find you. Ugh, I want my own palisman, not some trashy hand-me-down. You're lost. I want to be strong and wise to protect everyone I love. And if anyone gets in my way, they'll feel the sting of defeat. Tender yet tenacious, Clover gives her support. Oh! <gasps> oh my gosh! I'm gonna take such good care of you. Beautiful, just beautiful. Out of my way! I want to play professional grudgeby. <laughs> A competitive spirit. Maya will be thrilled. <gasps> okay, this is pretty cool. I want to open my own veterinary clinic for mythical pets. <gasps> All right. Deb wants me to become a master illusionist, but that's easy. So instead, I'll become an ambassador to the human realm and reestablish contact with the giraffes. I just want to make it to graduation. <gasps> <gasps> yes! So oh, cute! So cute. Oh, wow. I want to be a witch! Uh, probably just takes a little longer, because I'm human, right? Palisman born through emotion. I do not sense any conviction from you. That's impossible. I'm loose. I'm chock full of conviction. Perhaps specificity would help. There are many kinds of witches. What do you hope to accomplish with your magic? Oh, uh, get home to my mom? Would you still train to be a witch in the human realm? Can you even do magic there? Huh, I guess I never thought that far ahead. You okay, Luz? Mm. I stayed here because I wanted to learn magic, right? I wanted to be a witch like Ida and Azura. But what does that even mean? And I've read stories like this. The main character always has to return home, and what? Did I expect to be a witch back in Connecticut? Mm, yeah. I wouldn't want to be my palisman either. It's you. Did you come here for me? No, of course not. Come on, little dude. I'll take you back to your nest. How are we supposed to get through this? Ooh, palisman powers. Neat. All right, I'm not leaving here until I figure out what my future is and one of you becomes my palisman. live at the Emperor's Castle. Hmm? In light of Scooter Crane's retirement, today's ceremony will confirm Rain Whispers as the next head of the Bard Coven. Do I have to be on camera? For Titan's sake, just say something. Uh... I am honored to work with Emperor Bellos in preparation for the Day of Unibee. I mean Unilee. I mean... Uh, oh no, this is going all wrong. Get me out of here! Just cut the feed. How are you supposed to be head bard with stage fright? I'm sorry, Luce. 
It's okay, buddy. Hey, Ida, got another backpack I can borrow? This one got a little thrown up in. Closet. So why are you suddenly so interested in flying? Did you give up on returning to the human realm? I mean, I suppose you can stay here a, a little longer. Oh, no, I'm still going home, but I keep running into some setbacks. Come on, little buddy. You got portal info that I need? You want a carrot? Does baby like carrots? Here we go. It's okay, see? You're safe here. <laughs> Fear not, maiden! Hootie, the guardian owl of Gahoot, has protected you once more! I was able to get the mouse back safely, but he needs to recover. In the meantime, this weekend is the Gland Prix! Hexide, Glandis, and St. Epiderm students race to win glory and honor and... Fame! Winners also get an interview with the Boiling Isles News! Do you realize what this means? We're gonna enter the competition and get King on camera to send a message to his dad! Oh, that's great. But... Ah, uh, there's something I'd like to talk to you about first. You see, I think it's time for me to leave. Leave the talking for later. If you want to win, there's no time for talk. You gotta go practice, now. Wanna head back out while your tummy's empty? Okay, let's go. <laughs> <sighs> I just uh, don't want to hear him say it, you know? I was finally getting used to having people in the house, then whoosh, rugs ripped out from underneath me. Sure, I get it. It's like every time you come in here, I think, maybe she'll pay her tab this time. Hey, back off! Don't yeah. fret, citizens! Yeah. We are helping this wild witch find her place in society. No, I don't want to join a coven. Let me go! Throw it on my tab, Kevin. Ugh. Let her go! Back off, Owl Lady. Yeah, no coven wants a powerless witch. Oh! How's that for powerless? Ooh! Look at the Emperor's lackeys. Trying to, uh... Do I really have to say this? We all agreed on the script. Trying to... mute the music of our hearts? Oh... And weaken magic by forcing witches into covens against their will. Blasphemy! Blasphem you! See? You're a natural. That's right, Bonesboro. <laughs> they take your magic. They restrict your knowledge. Stop, stop. They say they do it in the name of unity, but what they really want is control. You know what we say to that, folks? Shove off! No more! No, 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 Who are you heroes? We are the bards against the throne, a.k.a. Surrounded! folks word of advice next time you put on a performance like that make sure you have an exit strategy thank you how can we ever repay you well you could let me join your little team <gasps> hey i may not have magic but i am an agent of chaos sorry we're not accepting new members is that any way to treat an old friend rain whispers What's going on? I don't know, but things always get weird when Hootie's upset. Whoa! Loose! Loose! Run! <laughs> did you do that? I... I think I did? I think I got a power! Are you two okay? Oh, not as okay as you. Dang, girl. I have a few questions for later. <laughs> I failed you all! I failed you all! No, 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 Hootie. You actually weirdly helped me. I'm like a harpy woman now. And I can explode things with my voice powers. But I still failed Luz! Luz, what was Hootie trying to do? Quick, pretend he helped you before he destroys everything. <laughs> 
was trying to help me ask Amity out. Oh, whoa. Do you wanna? Mm-hmm. Then do it! Like this? <laughs> yeah, I hear ya. I might be able to help. It won't be perfect, but... Huh? Does it really need to be? Good luck, kid! <laughs> Amity? <laughs> oh my gosh, Amity, are you okay? I'm all right. I was just... I've been wanting to ask you something for a while. But I wanted to do it in the best way, and in the tunnel of love, I thought... Amity's too cool for this. I'm not as cool as you think. Okay. Everything is so crazy right now, and I have no idea what my future holds, but it would be so cool if you were in it. So, uh... <sighs> do you want to go out with me? <gasps> no, I was so ready. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, you can say it. <sighs> okay. Amity Blight, do you want to go out with me? Yes! <laughs> okay! Why is this still so scary? I don't know. Dang, Hootie, you really are something. Your words inspired me to help everyone, Lulu. So I'll start with King. Maybe if I figure out what kind of demon I am, I'll know what's going on. But nothing in here looks like me. Our little bundle of joy was growing up and he had questions. As the only other demon in the house, I had answers. But would he accept help from me? Never. Unless... Did you owl pellet me? Are you angry? Sweaty? Is there hair in places? Does your voice crack in a super embarrassing way? I have the answers you seek. You're going through demon puberty. Ugh. The last thing I want from you is a health class. This isn't a health class. It's an unholy test to determine what kind of demon you are. Really? Yep. Besides, I'm pretty sure I'm the only other demon here, so <laughs> what other choice do you have? Uh, all right. What the heck? Yay! Our ancestors arose from the muck of a decomposing titan, and there are so many of us. But all demons can be placed in three categories. Bug, biped, and beast. Yeah, okay, everyone knows about the three Bs. Do not interrupt! Now, I'm pretty sure you're not a bug, but we can't rule anything out. As a type of worm myself, <laughs> I'm an expert on this subject. Let's begin! <laughs> Bug types naturally communicate through dance. Like so. <laughs> Poetic! <laughs> You talk about my mother! Yeah. Ah! 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 Whew. Well, don't mind me. I'm just learning how to turn into Harpy Eda on command. According to these human workouts, you just gotta scream a lot till you force your inner beast out. Ah! 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 This looks ancient. What? No, it's only 30 years old. I remember seeing this in theaters. Guess you're old, who cares? We have a crisis on our hands. Chill, bossy boots. Everything's fine. Does this seem fine to you? Whoa! It's like I have snakes for arms. Please. She just has a common mold. It's harmless. But she's a human. We have no idea how it'll affect her. If I hit the portal key, would I return to the human realm? Uh -uh. Um? I am not giving this back until you're better, okay? Mm. Oh, uh, you got it. Got to admit, Amity, seeing you around more often is different. I know. But I was taught to see every situation as an opportunity. And today, I'll show Luz that I am an awesome girlfriend. Feels like just a few months ago, you almost got her dissected by your crazy principal. 
That was a few months ago. Ah! Yes. <gasps> Mouse! Philip diary entry! After five years, I have finally found it. A power source so potent it can pierce through realms. Titan's blood. There are old tales of lakes reflecting green trees and blue skies. The Titan's veins run through the land, and many believe that these wild portals are created when a little of its blood leaks into the water. That is how I came here, so that is the first place I shall look. I will journey back to Eclipse Lake. <laughs> I have to go to Eclipse Lake! <laughs> <laughs> Liz, no, you are not well. She is shockingly strong. <sighs> All right, Luz. Me and King will get your Titan blood if you just calm down. Yes! Perfect chance to take our new powers for a test drive. You guys are the best. I volunteer as well. As Luz's girlfriend, I must... I get it, Boots. Just grab a coat. Willow, Goops, watch over Luz. She thinks she has snakes for arms. <gasps> Dig faster, Scouts! Kikimura, these tunnels are unstable. Maybe we should slow down? Ugh. Not now, Captain. This could be my last chance to show Bellows what I can do. And I just know that brat Golden Guard will try to spoil it. Hey, Steve! Jump over that chasm before I throw you in it! <sighs> She's getting so paranoid. Why do you keep following me? I don't speak palisman. Here's a plan. I slip in with this disguise, I find the Titan blood before Kiki, I give it to Bellows, boom! I'm useful again! Ma'am, is everything all right? I just thought I heard an annoying voice. Ah, another way in. We'll, we'll find another way in. <laughs> the owl lady and her dog. And is that the youngest blight? This place is crawling with tools. What gives? Titan blood is the most powerful source of magic on the Isles. I'm not surprised Bellos wants it too. Well, we can't afford to mess this up. Luce is counting on me. I mean, us. All right, new plan. They can lead us to- Hey, hey! Ah! A coven scout! Uh, yes! I am but a humble scout and I surrender. Well, that was easy. Not so fast, King. Don't you recognize that annoying voice? Why does everyone say that? <laughs> Don't let him get away! <laughs> this is none other than Bellos' right-hand man. <gasps> the Golden Guard? He is a lot scrawnier than I imagined. <laughs> <laughs> Worked. Did it? That looks real different from the old door. Yeah, but this is my one chance to see my mom. If it looks like it's closing, pull. Those, as impressive as this is, I don't want you getting hurt. Once I make sure my mom is okay, I'll be right back. Just be careful. The human realms are filled with some real weirdos. <laughs> don't forget to mention me! Okay. <laughs> Did I do something wrong? Ida? King? Booty? Can anyone hear me? Am I back at the Owl House? Whoa! Whoa! I think I'm in the reflection. Do you think she's safe? She's made it this far. We just have to trust her. I wonder if I could see Amity. Ah! Oh, no, no, no! Come on, Moose, you're on a mission. Camila, Camila, no sé that of the human realm. Oh, yeah. 
help? Oh, are you done cleaning your room? Almost. With all that old stuff gone, I feel like a whole new person. Evil doppelganger! Mom! Mom! Oh, I can finish up here, Miha. Thanks, Mom. Follow her! Listeners in at 2.0. Doppelganger, why won't you work? <sighs> okay, Luz, calm down. Just breathe and count to five. A new life. You! So you can hear me. You're from the demon realm. Listen, I just wanna... I'm not going back. I... I won't go back! Luz? Está todo bien? Si, sí, mamá. I just saw a spoiler for Monster Slayer Academia. I will never understand anime. Huh? Oh, wait! <laughs> So this is it. I'm gonna have to run again. Why couldn't this just work out? Stop moving. You'll make it tighter. Huh? I didn't mean to freak you out. I just want to figure out what's going on, okay? You're a demon from the Boiling Isles, aren't you? Mm-hmm. What's your name? I'm number five. I, I mean, I'm V. Okay, V. I'm gonna help free you. You're gonna be all right. Now, back up a bit, give the wire some slack. Now, look for a little metal thingamabob. Uh, sorry, I don't know what it's called. There you go. Nice and easy. Ah, 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 thank you. You must be Camila's real daughter. I am, but right now I'm trapped in the boiling aisles. Who are you and why are you pretending to be me? I'm... Just looking for a place to belong. You were missing, and Mom... I mean, uh, Camila seems so kind. So I stayed with her, but uh, I'll go if you want... Oh, wait! Maybe we can help each other. Today, I was gonna tell my mom where I've been. But because of you, she hasn't realized I've been missing. So, keep living in my place. For now. When I get back, I can introduce her to the demon realm and help you find a place to live. There's one problem. I need magic to transform, and I, uh, just use the rest of it. Hmm. Oh, that's where we can get some magic. Secrets of Gravesfield? No, no, that's junk. Turn it over. Strange woman banned from cafe. That's Ida, the owl lady. She's been coming here for years. She might have left some magic stuff behind. Okay, we can try. 